Hey guys, so clearly, as you can see, I'm like addicted to Jarman at this point. Um, I'm just gonna keep watching a bunch of his, his videos as much as I can this weekend because it's my weekend off, and then of course I'll be working. So hopefully, I'll be able to have some videos consistently for a couple days at least. Um, this one is going to be Rich Athlete. Sorry, I'm just loading up. But honestly, these videos are really good, really inspirational, and I love them. Like I cry to some of them, even some that I like rewatch with my sister. I'm almost crying again, and that's crazy. Okay, so this is Rich Athlete, and it's just so weird seeing like the actors because like one is so mean in one, and, and and then you see them they're so nice. Like they're really good actors. I love every, everything about uh, Jarman. It's, it's really good. So Rich Athlete shames this poor athlete. What happens next is shocking, like it always is. So this is only about six minutes long. So let's go, guys. One day I'm gonna be the number one tennis player in the league. I don't know, man. Raphael's number one. Hey, hey, you just stepped on my brand new shoes, bro. I'm so sorry, Raphael. How'd you like it if I stepped on you? <laughs> yeah, I mean, your shoes are so busted, if I stepped on them, it wouldn't make a difference, bro. <laughs> yeah. well, I doesn't have a lot of money, so I can't buy new shoes. Yeah, 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 we can tell, buddy. <laughs> no wonder he sucks at tennis, oh. right? <laughs> I mean, oh, 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 I got that that was like a disc or something, like that's... Out of my weight, bum. How do you even do that? I'm so rude. How do you even... Like, his shoes aren't even bad. Like, I need normal shoes to me. Like, what, like, what kind of shoes do you need? Oh, that's ridiculous. I can't believe Yo, this actually happens. That is a sick racket, dude. <laughs> I just didn't know this actually happens. It's actually crazy. Have it custom strung for me. Dang. So, I mean, you know, it's a Dang. way have to have the best, am I right? <laughs> hey, 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 poor boy. Don't tell me that's your racket. That looks like a normal racket. Yeah, why? That looks like it a looks base. like it's from the Goodwill, dude. <laughs> bro, it looks like it's a hundred years old or something, bro. It's my dad's racket from when he used to play. Hey, you know, hey, let me see that, bro. It looks like a normal racket. Like, what's the difference? It, no, it's just a different color. Just that. Uh, that's the only difference. I'm not gonna lie. I, I wouldn't be caught dead with this thing. Come on, man. Just give it back. You know, listen up, okay? This is why you'll never win a tennis game. Right? <laughs> wow, well, that's... Now, as you all know, league championships are coming. Not that there will be any surprise with who wins. Hey! <laughs> so... Let's start with practicing serve. Hey, Coach. So ridiculous. There was a problem with Roger's payment. What do you mean? His dad's check bounce, so he hasn't paid for any lessons. Aww. Okay, I mean, come on, is it really a surprise? Okay, really? Why the hell would you laugh at that? Like, you should feel bad if anything. I mean, come on. I'm sorry, Roger. You won't be able to play with us today. <laughs> Are you laughing at that? I, I, I be sad and I'd want to pay, pay for it, not... What? Hey, 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 by the way, by the way, you might as well just quit, you broke boy. <laughs> <laughs> like, what is wrong with these kids? Hey. Hey, Roger. How was practice? It was horrible. They got made fun of. And they said I couldn't even play because your check bounced. Oh, Roger, I'm sorry. I swear I had enough. It's so sad. Okay, like, whatever well, it is, I would want to pay. You know what I mean? I'll Just help. forget it. I'm never going to win with these beat up shoes and this old crappy racket. I give up. What, you think I became champion because I had nice equipment? Yeah, that's, that, that's irrelevant. It's not about that. Wait. You were the champion? Are you high school stuff? Yeah, I was. Oh, sure. Oh, I, I had no idea. And you won playing with that racket? It, yeah, it doesn't matter the racket, racket like, who cares? Fancy shoes. It's all how you play. Even lessons. It's all how you play. Because winning is not about what you have. It's about being willing to work hard enough. Like, I, I love people his prove story, bullies wrong, and it just makes them look like, idi idi idiotic. Dream again. I mean, don't put people down because of that. He That's just ridiculous. He starts practicing every single day with his dad, working really hard to improve his game. Over time, 
he starts getting really good. I, I really want to see him. I really want to see him beat that kid. He I don't know his name. He defeats his first opponent. Mm. He even wins his second match. Awesome. Roger continues beating all <laughs> yeah, of his opponents yeah, beat that and stupid makes bitch. it all the way to the finals. Against that guy. What's his name? With his old gear, oh, Roger yeah. now faces off against none other than Rafael, oh, yeah, Rafael. in the championships. Let's see how it is now. There you go. In a stunning series of events, Roger now leads Rafael seven points to six in this third set tiebreaker. Yeah, now what he you're gonna say? Four match point. Yeah, now what are you gonna say, huh? Same on shit. Yes, yes. Slam that shit. There you go. Yes. Roger, yeah. Oh yeah, now it's and now it's Rafael gonna say. Oh, thank you. So tell us, how does an unranked player playing with some old shoes and an old tennis racket go on to win a championship? Well, <laughs> a wise man once told me, winning isn't about what you have. It's about how hard you're willing to work. Samantha, I don't know what's going on with you. But this is the second time you're late to my class this week. If it happens again, I'm sending you to the principal's office. Like, shit, ooh, like shit happens. Like I don't understand what's. These just piss me off, Mac. No one. These are so freaking popular. These. These guys are so good, but they're triggering at the same time. It's kind of like a lot of ones are like um really big in some aspects. Like you know, like a lot are like some are bigger than others. You know, bigger like. Around the world happening right now, like maybe stuff, stuff, stuff to do with race or fat shaming, you know? <sighs> I just hate that um, this video, um, like I didn't really get to see like Raphael's reaction or like him, him apologizing because that's what I love when, uh, when, uh, when a bully looks stupid, like when you know, like you keep it going when someone tells you that, that, that you suck, you know? Like I love stories like that where people go get, get, get past all the, all the bullying and then there you go, you know, like you're all good. I love when that happens. It's just so like inspiring. It's it's really good to like keep going on your dream. Don't give up. Don't give up just because some bitch said you're not gonna announce anything. Like that's not about it's, it's not about that. Like you can do whatever you set your mind to. And as long as you remember that, then you're all good. Like that's all you have to do is have con confidence in yourself and you can do it. You know what I mean? It it can be hard to have confidence in yourself, but like you can do it. You know what I mean? Like you can do it. Don't lose faith. Don't, you know. Just it, just believe you can do it. Practice and then you can. It's even inspiring for me. Just like watch these. It's it, it it's inspiring for me to Want to try again? I don't really do anything with my life, but it's hard to, you know, be like, yeah, it's definitely possible to like, you know, do what you believe that you can do. You know what I mean? Just, just, just work hard and you can do it, and then you can prove the, the, the naysayers or whatever you want to call them wrong, and then, and then there you go. Who looks stupid now? Anyways, that, that was definitely a really good video. Again, uh, being rich does not mean you're the best. Being poor, as you can say, or with an old shoes and old racket, that doesn't mean anything, you know? Like, you can win with whatever you have, it depends how good you practice, obviously that guy didn't practice hard enough, and I see how cocky some people are, like, like, you might as well already give the thing to me, like, bitch, why are you assuming that I'm just gonna die or just gonna win, like, you, you don't know what they're doing, you don't know if they've been practicing, you don't know how good they are, but just because they're struggling doesn't mean you'll easily beat them, like, they can easily practice and get better, to, and then, but it get better than you, so... I hate how some people are just like that. It's so annoying. Anyways, it's, that's going to be it for this video. Please be sure to subscribe if you are new. Be sure to comment down below any thoughts you guys have on this video. And comment any other darn videos that you want me to watch. Of course, I will watch them all eventually. Because I definitely need to see every single one. Um, I'm probably just going to go on like a darn man, like, like a grand page like I already have been. <laughs> and you guys are probably going to be what's... Be wondering what's going on with these uh, drama videos. I just I love them. Like I honestly love these more than horror stories right now, which is probably insane because I always thought I'd be watching horror stories only. But I love these too. So, anyways, that's gonna be it. I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching and peace out.